Item Number SCP-823 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-823 is to be secured by no fewer than six on-site personnel until such a time as decontamination protocols can be established and the artifact in question neutralized. Personnel must respect a 20-meter safe zone around the currently established red or no-entry zone at all costs. Any individual, civilian or not, who enters the established red zone is to be terminated immediately by sniper fire. Should music or piping be heard emanating from within the red zone, Foundation personnel on site are to immediately don protective earplugs and withdraw from their positions to a 2km perimeter, beyond the currently established yellow or no civilians presence zone, and inform Foundation scientific personnel immediately. Following the realignment event, Foundation science personnel will survey the area and determine the boundaries of the new red and yellow zones using Procedure 823-1-Alpha. Due to the necessity of maintaining auditory alertness, no personal music devices or radios aside from necessary equipment are to be allowed at the observation site. Description: SCP-823 is an abandoned theme park located in The site was abandoned in after several violent events resulting in the deaths of park attendees. A complete list of said events is included in Supplement 823-01-13, Civilian Deaths Attributed to SCP-823. SCP-823 was finally abandoned after the events of also known as Bloody Sunday, when the influence of the artifact in question reached a 20-year peak. 231 attendees were killed, and another 7 injured or maimed. A complete list of casualties is included in Supplement 823-01-14, Civilian Deaths Resulting from Event 823-99-Euclid, but include Two individuals, male and female, fused together at multiple points after emerging from the Tunnel of Love Dark Ride. Dead. One individual wearing a Happy Hippo mascot uniform found dead of suffocation. Mouth, trachea, and lungs were discovered to be filled with a fibrous substance later determined to be identical to the stuffing in said mascot uniform. Dead. Fifteen individuals recovered from the Thriller Chiller roller coaster, all decapitated by blunt force. Witnesses reported that the deaths did not occur simultaneously, but in groups of two, starting with the front row of seats and ending with the back. Forensic analysis indicates that each set of deaths corresponded to a loop or turn in the roller coaster's tracks. Dead. One individual recovered from under the Thriller Chiller roller coaster, dead of broken neck and massive cranial trauma caused by a 50-foot fall from an inverted position. Individual was seated at the back of said roller coaster and somehow managed to extricate himself from the ride's safety harness halfway through the ride. Dead. One individual found dismembered inside the House of Mirrors attraction. Left arm was found 16 feet to the north from the torso. Left leg was found inverted and attached to the ceiling by sinews. Right leg was found in the possession of Subject 79, partially consumed. Forensic analysis indicates that teeth marks found on the flesh and bone of said leg are human in origin. To date, no trace of right arm has been found. Alive. For a complete record of casualties, please see Supplement 823-01-14, Civilian Deaths Resulting from Event 823-99-Euclid. Following said event, Foundation Mobile Task Force Row 71, Origami Toads, was sent into the site to assess the situation and carry out containment procedures. MTF Row 71 was not successful in determining the cause or location of the deaths due to casualties inflicted on team members. See Supplement 823-01-15, Casualties Among MTF Row 71 Resulting from Event 823-99-Euclid. Partial list of casualties included MTF Row 71 Commander Cause of death, suicide caused by forced sexual entry through left eye, resulting in unsurvivable brain trauma. Agent Cause of death, suicide, individual was found with all ammunition disassembled, casings and bullets discarded. Grams of propellant, consistent with the amount of disassembled ammunition found on scene, were retrieved from the individual's stomach and intestines. Agent Cause of death Suicide. Individual was discovered with lacerated lungs and broken jaw. Missing teeth were retrieved from the individual's lungs and trachea. 
For a complete record of casualties, please see Supplement 823-01-15, Casualties Among MTF Row 71 Resulting from Event 823-99-Euclid. Following the deaths of 50% of the Mobile Task Force personnel, the on-site supervisor ordered an immediate mission abort. Containment protocol was switched from retrieval to on-site securement. Standard media blackout procedures were carried out, including Addendum 823-01 RE Destruction of Site Per 05 level order, request for immediate destruction of site by airstrike to be led by MTF New 7 Hammer Down is denied due to lack of proximity to civilian population, lack of plausible cover story scenario, and unknown nature of the artifact in question. Addendum 823-02 RE Red Zone as of this date, SCP-823 has undergone three realignment events requiring re-surveying of affected zones. Apparent range of red or no entry zone has increased in size by 5% during that time. Rate of expansion appears to be accelerating at a linear rate. See Report 823-02-07, Result of 7th Survey of SCP-823. Request Upgrade to Keter. Addendum 823-03 RE Upgrade to Keter Denied by O5 Council Reason Insufficient data to justify reclassification Thank you guys so much for watching and a huge thank you to all of my patrons on Patreon. Special shout out to my level 4 patrons, Alexis Zagrate. Lesby Friends, and Scrubversive, and a huge extra special shout out to my level 5 patrons, Anton and Dr. Serene. If you would like to see your name at the end of my videos, see my videos early, and get some other cool perks, head on over to patreon.com slash drmaxwell, link in the description.